Hey guys, we're here at Belconnen Community Theatre with Green Oaks Cabaret tonight and with me I've got Shaylee here, Jasmine and George who are all performing tonight. Firstly, Shaylee, I'm going to start with you because Green Oak Theatre is your company. What was the mission behind it? Why did you start it up? Um, well, the main purpose was because me and my friend had written a musical together and we wanted to uh, produce it and we needed a theatre company to do that. But now um, we're wanting to, you know, keep building and expanding and bring like original works and cabarets like this, which are really great opportunities for performers to just do random performances that, you know, they can't really fit into anything else. Um, so we're just kind of giving lots of performers in Canberra the opportunity to show their talent and to be able to um, work on original works here in Canberra as well. That's really fantastic. I mean, one of the most important things in any theatre community is the opportunity for people to get out and shine and show their absolute best. So you guys were doing a really interesting piece today. Uh, was that from anything in particular? And what was your, um, why did you choose that particular work today? Um, it's from a, an original play by Teresa Rebecca. It's called Spike Heels, uh, which is um, it's a it's a New York play. Um, yeah, and uh, we chose that one because uh, we're both uh, fans of American theatre, and uh, it was actually this lovely lady right here that uh, that got me into Spike Heels. So she just sent me the script one day, and I had to read through it, and I loved it. And um, yeah, we just we just got talking, and um, we decided to do that one scene uh, from 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 the second act, and we had a lot of fun doing it. It's a very powerful scene. It's a really yeah. deep. That, that, those characters in it and the relationship they have, that's that's really, really strong stuff. If there's a, going to be another cabaret, because this one was a fundraiser for your next production, which we'll talk about in just a second, but if there's another cabaret show to do, what would you guys like to do next? Um, it's really funny because there's a lot of different plays I've been looking at at the moment, a lot of comedy and dramas, and that's what Spike Hills was. It was a, it was a very interesting, like... It was a very interesting drama and comedy play with a lot of banter between the characters and we actually watched something from New York as well. It was from the original TV show called The Nanny and they did a mock-up scene like this really funny comedy sketch yeah. of Dynasty if anyone's familiar with that. Yeah, so, um, yeah, they, yeah they did it all very exaggerated. Exaggerated. Just, yeah. It looked like a very, very interesting type of comedy. Yeah. So we're thinking something on, along the lines of yeah, that. I yeah. think that would be like... Almost a step out of the comf comfort zone, but I personally like to do that. I personally like to really explore stories and get right into them. Um, yeah, definitely. Especially if they are powerful, so yeah. I'm, I'm always up for a challenge. Great. Right. Yeah. Well, I hope to see a lot more of that, and I'm a long-time nanny fan, so, so great oh, work. Awesome. <laughs> now, Shaylee, can you tell me about what your next work is going to be? Um, yes, yeah, so the reason we were doing this cabaret, apart from a great performance opportunity, is to raise money for our um, next production, um, which is an original play written by me um, called If I Could Save Her. Um, it's about, not giving too many spoilers away, it's about a um, man who knows his wife is going to die and he knows when she's going to die, but he doesn't exactly know how or the circumstances leading up to her death and so he's trying to um, prevent her death from happening without entirely knowing the circumstances around it. That's the premise of the story. Great. Yeah. And when's that going to be? Um, so we're auditioning in June and we're going to um, perform in October this year. Too. Right here in Belco. So. <laughs> <laughs> I have a lot of fun memories myself here. I've, I've acted in here, I've directed in here. It's actually a really good space. Guys, if you get a chance, come and check out what uh, Green Oak Theatre is doing. They're one of the rising companies here in Canberra. I'm really loving seeing what they're doing and giving all so many performers a chance. Thank you so much for joining me tonight, guys, and best of luck with it all. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Let's catch you next time, guys. Bye for now.